Now you know John Harbaugh hit up Jim tonight and was like, hey, you still going on that podcast? And Jim was like, yeah, I'm going on that podcast. And John told him, hey, please, because Lamar, he's driving us crazy. He's starting to mess with us again. And I don't want to have to go through this again, Jim. I don't want to have to go through this, man. So please, we, we need something to sort of try to distract the people. We know it's not going to work too much, but let's try to distract the people just a little bit. Because all this Lamar stuff is, is bothering me, man. So he was like, you know what? I'm going to give you this, Jim. Drop it. Drop it on the podcast. John Ross, he's going to make the roster. And Jim was like, okay, I'll be sure to tell him. And now we're here. So let's read the quote uh, from Inside Michigan Football Radio Show uh, from Jim Harbaugh. Really exciting news, too. My brother, John, says Josh is going to make the team. I meant to tell the team that today. Uh, he's doing great. John really thought that he would make the 53. They've got a record at the Ravens, like 18, 19 years of an undrafted player making the team. And it continues. He thought that Josh's special team ability, but his linebacker ability is what really is kind of a godsend for him to get a player like that to make the team at a position they really needed it at. You ain't lying. But back to the quote. And what separated him at the beginning was his special team's play. Hey, you, you know that's the ticket. With John Harbaugh, you know that's the ticket. You can play some good special teams, you're going to end up being a starter. But anyway, back to the quote. Uh, he said, what, and what separated him at the beginning was his special teams play, that he had been in a pro punt system. It was a huge advantage for him to be in a pro punt system like he was here at Michigan. The way uh, Jay, their special teams coordinator, uh, Harbaugh had taught him. And then it was second nature when he got to the Ravens. That gave him a big jump, and he just played his way into making the team. Tomorrow we'll find out, but looks great for Josh Ross. Hey, that's another thing, too. You don't want to go You don't want to go on a podcast and say something like this, and then tomorrow come, and they'd be like, oh, well, uh, yeah, I don't know where you heard that from, but we got some different information uh, in our paperwork. Please take a look at that. So ho hopefully that ain't the case, but it's, it's, it's looking good. I mean, throughout the preseason, it was looking good. Uh, for Ross, he was making a lot of plays. He was making a lot of tackles, um, and he just looked good. He looked good. Like we talked about earlier, he reminds me of C.J. Mosey. Um, and and the reason I say that is because C.J. Mosey, he didn't have this burst. He didn't have this explosiveness at the linebacker position, but he was smart. He knew how to di diagnose plays and be at the right place at the right time. And, and that's what Josh Ross has been at the right place at the right time, shooting the gap at the perfect moment to make a play in the backfield, wrap up tackling. All that good stuff. So, shout out to him, and I'm glad that he is expected uh, to make the roster. So, I wonder what this means for Christian Welch. Like, he got to be looking on social media like, oh, what? What's, okay. But we'll see. We'll see. Now we just got to wait it out. Tomorrow, everything becomes official. Um, and it was always looked at as a battle between these two, between Christian Welch and John Ross. Um, but if Ross is going to make the roster, then most likely Welch is out. Um, but linebacker has definitely been a need. It, it has definitely been a need because they are very thin uh, at that position. I uh, got Patrick Queen and Josh Bynes, and they sat out the whole preseason. So you expect them to make the roster. Uh, Malik Harrison, he played a lot. Um, Josh Ross obviously played a lot. Christian Welch did too. Um, so, yeah, man, we'll see how this whole thing shakes up. Uh, but it's, it's it's cool. It's a nice little breath of breath of fresh air uh, to be talking about somebody who is gonna be on this Ravens roster this upcoming season. Somebody who the Ravens are expected to give a contract to.